What's up guys? It's your girl Riva and I'm back again with another video. If you're new to this channel, hi, my name is Riva. It's very nice to meet you. Before we get into this video, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. And as I always say, make sure you guys leave your comments in the comment section down below. It does not matter how you feel about this video. We all want to talk about it. Also, if you're not following me on Instagram, follow my Instagram. It's at R-I-V-A-H underscore J-O-R-D-O-N. Um, yes, guys, if you missed my live last night, it was, oh my gosh, it was so impactful, such a good conversation, so edifying. Um, so make sure that you guys check that out. But I have not been on the scene doing my reactions. I had a very, very busy weekend. I had a lot of family in town. So we're back on it. Okay, we're back on it. And I'm really excited about this video because this is the first live stream that I've seen that has Kay, Kayla, Island Gal, Q, and Amir on it. So I'm really, really excited to get into the conversation. And also, I don't know what Anton has on, but I'm pretty sure we're going to find out. So let's just go ahead and get right into the video. Husband and wife, in terms of the hierarchy that you just mentioned, mm -hmm. besides father figure, like, do you think the man can still be at the top of the hierarchy without it being a father figure? No. Most men are emasculated. Most men, most men are simps. Listen, the reason why you got reason why you got so many weak men a day is because of the, the men of yesterday, the men of yesteryear failed us. There wasn't women. A lot of relationships were endured through. They weren't successfully married. Trill kind of highlighted. It. I am answering it. I'm saying that I'm giving a context to the answer. I'm saying that no, it can't exist without that hierarchy. And then no, the no, no, and that, it, I'm asking, is father figure the only way to have that hierarchy? Like, is there any yeah. other way? Okay, so no. you have to be a father figure to your wife, in yes. your opinion. Yes. Okay, okay. That's what I was asking. No, 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 no. no. Let, me, let me revise it. I'm, I'm wrong. I'm wrong. It I can work. Good. It can work in, in the context of staying married. Right. I don't think that you can be successfully married with, with, with that that's actually a really good question that she just asked so um i don't know there obviously was probably like more dialogue um than what was put into this you know short clip but yeah i, I think a man a woman as he just said there are marriages where you know the woman is the one who's running the marriage or she wear the pants or whatever the case is right and that's fine for them but um in terms of order and structure the way that it's supposed to be I think that it is um, indeed important for the man to be like sort of like a father figure to his wife because um, she will be able to respect him, take, you know, follow his lead, allow him to, you know, be in his leaders, leadership position um, and, uh, you know, take note from the things that he's saying, you know, take take the guidance, take the leadership a lot easier because of the uh, respect that she has for him. So I agree with that point. Oh, that being that hierarchy being there. Without the father figure, and so what would yes. the woman be? That's my that's my baby. Right. So like daughter figure. That's my baby girl. You know, I'm 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 speaking like that's my my that's my baby. You know, whatever. I see. Not daughter figure, but as women, we want to be babied, right? Like we want to be babied. We want to be catered to. We want the affection. You know, we want to be held when, you know, we're feeling some type of way. That's like a, the nature of a baby. So, yeah, like that's my baby. I, I completely, the dynamic makes sense. It's not a literal father, but it's the protector, the leader, the guidance for you. Um, and the woman is the one that's providing like the nurturing, the this, the that. So, yeah, it's a balance. It's balance. His eyes light up like, you like little babies? No, okay, I don't like babies, okay? Jeez. I didn't say that you did. I just don't like to refer as that like even in some relationships i think that we should stop calling men and women baby like that's refer baby. to him as refer to him as king not daddy and not no, he ain't, everybody no, baby. Is, no, he ain't no baby daddy. he ain't my daddy he is my king and i will oh, refer to him as king that Bigley, AKA Big i just yeah, I, I don't call <laughs> nobody daddy but my dad call like, him, i ain't call him no i no, have a daddy call, call me, i call call me my daddy, daddy. daddy. Yeah. That ain't my daddy but I think the name calling is irrelevant, to be honest. Um, I think, you know, whether it's baby, daddy, papi, um, you know, king, whatever, whatever it is, it's irrelevant. 
it's how you treat that person. And it's the respect and the esteem that's important. The name is, it don't mean nothing. If you if you call somebody daddy, and then the next thing you know, you turn on, you call them out of their name or you're disrespecting them. So the word, I think, is irrelevant, but it's it's how they're treated that's 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 supposed to take precedence. Okay, I'm getting so think, derailed think, in these conversations. Let me no ask you, let me ask you, really quickly. Kayla, what do you call your husband? I'm not married. I just, I was just wondering about what Anton said with the, because if, if that's the that's only like, way. Honestly, I call, I call her her name. I say Rita. Yeah. Like, oh, hold on, Amira, was there <laughs> You say Rita or my chick? Yeah, I call her my chick, too. Mm-hmm. It don't matter. No. Which is cool. My chick. <laughs> because um, I call her my chick because it puts me in a mindset of staying on my toes, not yeah. getting too comfortable. Like in the beginning type of thing. thing. Yeah, it's like, so, yo, I just met you for the first time every second. single day. I think that's the most important thing. It's not about the name, right? But if, if calling your husband daddy or calling, you know, your man daddy or king or baby whatever is going to keep you in the mind state of respect and honor in your relationship then that's what you need to do but the name it don't it don't really matter it really don't matter Amira, what was the purpose of the question because because you because you were talking about you were talking about like not calling someone baby so i was curious what do you call your husband but you said you're not married so i said that before I don't know you. This is my first time seeing you, so I don't know. No, in terms of if I said I don't call my man baby, if it was my husband, my man, I don't call them him baby and I don't call him daddy. It don't matter whether I'm married or not. If I was, I wouldn't call him baby. If I wasn't, I'm not calling him baby. So that's what I was okay. asking. Like, was there a purpose for you asking a question I had already answered? That's why I was asking. I gave you the reason why. Are you triggered or something? What's wrong? Yeah, but she just asked. She she didn't ask the focus of Amira's question from my standpoint, from the viewer standpoint, was just what do you call your spouse? You know, because the answer could have easily been like, oh, I'm not married, but I, I call my boyfriend this. She wanted to know the name that you call them, not the names that you don't call them. That's why she asked the question. So I'm kind of confused of how, you know, she's like, I answered... I answered that already, like... No, I had was wondering if you had, you know, you were listening or not. That's why I was asking. Because I had just said that. And then you asked me it. Okay, Island. You look pretty triggered. Awesome. I'm sorry if it triggered you. I didn't mean to trigger you. I was just asking. Just I mean, uh, stop really? trying to set up. You just get triggered like four times. Hey, 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 she didn't, Amira didn't start anything. Let's be honest, okay? Because I'm going to be real. Like, I when I view things, you guys know I love Amira, right? You guys know that's my sis. But when I view things, I give you guys my honest feedback. And I'm looking at the conversation just like a viewer. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not, I don't have any emotions in the conversations when I'm reacting to a video. And Amira asked a question. She said, what do you call your husband? And she said, I don't have a husband. And I was like, ooh, okay, you know. But she's asking, what do you call... She didn't have to say she doesn't have a husband. She could have said, I don't have a husband, I have a boyfriend, but I call him this. They went past the conversation, she brought the conversation back up, but she still didn't say what she does call her man. You know what I'm saying? And if it was her saying, like, oh, well, you know, oh, you don't have a husband, okay, sorry, blah, 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 like, you know what I'm saying? Then that would have been the dialogue. Oh, I was just trying to see if you had a husband, but she literally answered the question right away. So I don't feel like it was any other thing or I don't feel like it was any, you know, hidden. But now Kay is getting involved into the conversation with Amira and da -da -da. it's not that serious. It's really not that serious. I know you. Amira, you've learned from me well, but I'm still going to speak when I want to speak. No, let them have a conversation. Ain't nobody in the room. Let them have a conversation. It really isn't not my right. business or your business to butt in. Like, honestly, I mean, let them have it. I, mean, I, I like you because she, 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 she knows. <laughs> She's like, that has nothing to do with us. Let them continue their conversation. We don't need any, 
Uh, what they say? Comments from the peanut gallery? Yeah, we don't need none of that. That's true. It's not really any business that's happening. I said something. She no, asked me business. what I, I said, said yet again. So I was clarifying whether she was not following the conversation. Or We're the not even talking about you. We're talking to Kay. Point. She had a further point. No, we're talking point. about Kay. And that is I was why I was saying that. No, I, yeah, I think the question was taken out, out of context. I, 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 I think maybe she was asking, like, man, if, like, what? How come nobody's calling Trill to stop? Yeah, I was just asking, what do you call him? And then she's, like, offended. Go ahead, Island Chicago. Tell him I'm not about offended. Yeah, I'm just, how am I okay. offended by asking? I'm going to say if y'all are just biased against me. Uh, or okay. what? Because Island said the same thing. Hey. Hey. Island, what do you call your husband? So I'm trying to figure out. We both just said. But I would. Because Island and Kayla can both say the same thing, but it's the way that it's said. Why Amir is going to turn to you and ask you based off of you said the fact you just had a whole, you know, a couple minutes talking about how you wouldn't call them baby and you're not going to call your man daddy because you have a daddy. You know, you're going to call your man. You would, uh, you know, you think that people should refer to each other as king. So she just asking you like, OK, so what do you refer to your man as? Do you literally call your man king? Is that the only name that you call him or is there something different like, you know, a term of endearment that you call your man? And it just, you know, spiraled into this whole out of context situation. Took it that way, Kayla. I honestly, I if she was I, 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 I really asked the question because she asked that. So I was literally waiting for the follow up to see what point she was trying to make. And she didn't have one. She didn't, literally didn't even respond. So I said, well, what are we doing but that for? She did respond. She did have an answer. She did tell you tell you the reason why. She did. No, what? Kayla. Kayla, what else am I supposed to say when you see say, take I'm this. All of you. Look at all the Either people that don't jump in, jumping in. <laughs> no, because it, you know, if if Kayla if Kayla would have responded and said, "I don't have a husband, but I have a boyfriend." And I call him this. If she would have answered the question, it would have continued, but it kind of made the the situation a little awkward when she was just like, "I don't have a husband." So it was just like, "Ooh." Like it Kayla kind of made that situation kind of like a mic drop moment w because of the way that she answered the question. But it really, I, I feel like she was just wanted to ask like, okay, well, you say all these things that you don't call your man. What do you call your man? Was really the context of the question. It's so weird. Like y'all like when it's somebody does weird. something. The same thing that I was doing to Kate with Kayla, and now it's cool. Like, and then Trill comes in and happens, and y'all are so inconsistent. Like, come on, even if we don't agree, at least be consistent with your things you say and All do. right, well, and if you're going to do that, then don't say, Anton, why you always defending Amir, because Amir is right. Amir, okay, so the context from my perspective in this conversation is in like, this show, like, no, 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 you want to do this? Let's do it. So the context is that Amir, Amir is very similar to me, <laughs> and that often at times, she doesn't look at things as a relationship. She only look at it as married or single. So, uh, so when she refers to something, often at times, she's referring to marriage, so it's just in her to state that when she's asking a question to another woman because she's married so because you know and that's normal like because she's married she's like oh so your husband do you usually do that and she's just gonna answer and say i'm not married but like a person who's not married and is not bothered by the question what do you ask your husband they're just gonna say oh i'm not married but i call my boyfriend this they would have just answered the question that's exactly what i was trying to do. i didn't say anything about that what do you are you talking to me anton i'm Kate, no, no, Kate. He's just talking about the situation. He's just explaining what just happened. That's that's all. No, <laughs> no, Kate. Uh, everybody, I'm talking to Kate. I'm talking to you. I'm talking to everybody. Oh, well, I, he the we who have ears, let him listen. Anton, the way that you put the ears back <laughs> before you were about to like make your point, I cannot. Um, he oh, flew, he flicked them ears back. And then he was like, wait. That's because I got a broke ear. This one is, I don't know what's wrong with this. It looked like it was broke. born a couple of times. Just floppy. Oh, 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 it went back. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my goodness. I'm just saying, like, we can't, like, let's just not. Like, I love, um, uh, so it's obviously going to stop right here, but I really like Kayla's braids, though. Um, 
I, I think she always wears her hair pretty much in braids, but I like the, the style, like the parting of the braids that she has. It looks nice. But, yeah, I think this is also just miscommunication. And I think, you know, you know it wouldn't be me if I don't say how I feel. But I just feel like, I feel like, and yes, I know you guys don't like that feel, but I'm just being honest. You know, in my opinion, when you're used to just kind of like going off, it's easy to just go off. You know, even when it's not necessary, like when it's not necessary or when somebody wasn't trying to do a certain thing, you're just so usually, you're just so um, on the defense that you're easily defensive about a situation that it kind of wasn't necessary. You know, it, she could have easily just corrected her within the conversation and then everybody would have just continued talking. It wouldn't have been like this whole big thing when, you know, we didn't even get to the context of the situation of what Anton was saying about being, you know, this, 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 that. So I, I, just, I just think that that was like a miscommunication, a very, very surface level miscommunication that kind of spawned into a different thing. But let me know what you guys think about this in the comment section down below. I generally want to see you guys' feedback and opinion of the conversation and how you viewed it. So make sure you guys leave your comments in the comment section down below. Again, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, give this video a thumbs up. And again, if you're not following me on Instagram, Follow my Instagram, it's at R-I-V-A-H underscore J-O-R-D-O-N. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in the next video. Love you.